welcome to or welcome back to my channel so i hope you're doing very, very well today today's video is going to be a vlog down at the farm i feel like i've done these for the last few like christmases and halloweens where i go and vlog the christmas event or the halloween event that we do so i'll catch you guys up later on exactly what is going on but i'm about to start off in my car down to the farm now um i'm working 10 to 12 for today so it's not too long but i'm gonna go head down there now and i catch up with you guys soon i hope you all enjoy this video do not forget to smash that thumbs up button leave me a lovely little comment and make sure to subscribe to my channel for more content just like this and let's get started with today's video I have just arrived at the farm and it's now about 10 o'clock so I'm going to get out of my car I'm going to sort my shoes out because I'm currently wearing these pumps and these are not going to be good for working on a farm so I'm going to grab my boots out the back I'm going to stick my coat on because I've just got a tar top on at the moment and it is absolutely freezing today so I'm going to get a coat on I might even stick a hat on and get some gloves on and we'll see how cold it is so I'm going to get out, start working and I'll take you guys along a day with me if you guys have seen these before you'll know the kind of how it goes if not i will catch up with you guys soon it's a bit of a rush in the morning but it'll calm down in the breaks so i'll explain a little bit more and chat to you guys then we are still on our first session of the day and i've literally just looked at my camera and i've got two bars of charge which is very frustrating so we might do more filming tomorrow than we do today because it's gonna be like a double vlog because i'm gonna be here for two days but it is decorated so gorgeously like look at all the lights they are so so pretty so yeah we're on slot one of the day i think it's like an hour and a half long i'm pretty sure anyway so we've only got i think two families in the slot which isn't too many at all i think we've got up to five families that can book so far the last slot of the day isn't actually full at all we've got no one in there yet so we may end up finishing like an hour and a half earlier but we'll see i didn't actually bring any food with me so i'm gonna go grab my bottle of water because i'm quite thirsty i don't think i've had anything to eat or drink today so i'm gonna go up to my car and grab that while i wait for the next family to come around it's now about 11 o'clock and i switched to my phone because i've got to charge the batteries for my camera so if the quality isn't as good that is why i genuinely just want to get my hair done every single christmas whatever like winter i end up getting my hair done because i'm gonna do it every six months and then it ends up being a year and then i get it done but i got mine done a little bit earlier this year so now it's not been done for a while i just want to get it done so bad i'm just popping back over to the farm i went to go grab a drink so i'm popping back over to the farm now i'm gonna go see how it's all getting along i genuinely feel like i have been here and forever i used to come here like at least once a week twice a week something like that but it's really nice to be back i want to come back down and start volunteering again doing like cleaning and stuff for them again so i've turned the polytunnel into like a little santa's grotto and i'm obsessed with the lights like it looks so so cute it's like a little tunnel with the hair and we've got Larry, got some of the little sheep. We've got this nativity set up at the back, which I think is really, really cute. And then we saw the little sheep trying to get my shoes. Then you can go through this little tunnel. And as you go through here. We've got all of the alpacas munching and they've got this backdrop at the back as well. Hey guys. We have our racetrack set up, but it is a little bit muddy for that turn, a little bit cold. So I don't know how many people will be using it, but as you can see, it has already been used so far. I'm gonna go down here to give the donkeys a treat. Now I'm wearing the Christmas jumpers which is so cute and it keeps them nice and warm. Timmy's coming to say hi. Hi! I'm going to get them a treat now and just sprinkle this out. We have just finished the first group of people and we've got some very naughty donkeys that I've been watching. And um, yeah, the first lot of people have now finished and gone. It's about lunchtime, so we're waiting for the next lot of people to come. We're also waiting for an Iceland delivery, so we don't know how that's going to work at the parking, but it'll be fine. I don't know if I'm going to get in copyright for this music playing in the background, so I'm going to walk away from it quickly, and hopefully we don't. Uh, we've got a few escapee goats. But yeah, it's absolutely freezing. I feel like I didn't learn at all from last year. We've got all the chickens over here in pens, because obviously the bird flies around, so they all need to be contained. But look at how big they are they look so happy and they're nicely decorated pens 
we've got these letters as well that we've just put up everywhere and it's basically like a treasure hunt kind of thing a puzzle of people so you can go around find the letters and do the little games like word search and stuff like that just another way to keep people like entertained and for the kids a bit of fun as well but i'm gonna go into the little grotto now we had this late last year and the reindeers are so cute I'm making my way down to the little shed. It's like a little grotto. Um, I'm gonna see if Beth will make me a hot chocolate because I'm very, very cold. But the decoration is so nice. That's another one of the letters I've stuck up. Got some little escapees, as always. There's the cow. And then there's the little playground up there, which is actually, it's so cute. So this is just what inside the little shed looks like. And I love the lights. It just makes it feel so Christmassy. Got a little Christmas tree there, a little elf. And then coming over here, got the little blow up ones. And then we've got a little tea, coffee, and snack section at Beth's shop. Currently, part way through our second session, I'm just getting rid of some balls because these are the balls that we give people to feed the animals with. So it's got like ready grass in. Uh, so I'm just going to get rid of some of these and fill some more up. We've had quite a successful session this one. Everybody's turned up. It's really, really nice. I haven't had a hot chocolate yet, so I need to do that next, I think, though, because it is freezing. So I'm just making myself a hot chocolate, but the teaspoon's literally just like sunk. So most of the families from the second set of groups have left now. I'm just so here with my hot chocolate. I'm waiting by like the little reception bit that we've made for the next families to come. I've got the ducks behind me. Honestly, ducks are one of my favorite animals. Like there are some cool animals here, like pigs, cows, sheep, everything, but ducks, ducks just do it for me. They're really, really cool. We are on our last session of the day and just come into the barn. I've got Hope there. Hi. Got some more goats in there, some of the chickens. That's Kitty with her babies. I do love this. I think this scene is really nice. Another little Christmas tree there. It's so cute. I do love their Christmas jumpers though. They seem to absolutely love them every year. It's getting so foggy now. Like at least it stopped raining, but it is getting very, very foggy. So I've just been see the piggies. And then over here with the goats. Rosie and Rosa. There's all sorts of other pigs and goats and sheep and cows. I think we have about an hour left of today's ones. Everyone's has actually showed up, which is good because last year we had a few no-shows because of the weather. Thankfully, it hasn't got too bad with the weather today. Um, I'm just with the cows at the moment. <laughs> they are so cute. Um, they have to be my favourite cows of these ones. They're really, really cool. But yeah, we have done quite a lot today. I'm probably gonna go get myself a KFC or something because I'm really hungry. Uh, but it's a really good bit of a drive because when I first started working here, I couldn't drive. So my dad would always have to like pick me up and stuff. But now it's quite easy now that I can actually drive. I've just been in with the bunnies and guinea pigs, letting little children hold them. So we've got three bunnies in here, which are gorgeous. And then here we've got some guinea pigs. They did not want me to let them catch them. That was not easy, but they're in there. Honestly, they're so cute when they just sit in the bowl. <laughs> so I'm just nipping down to Sainsbury's before I head to the farm. I need to grab some sellotape and then probably some to eat as well, so I've got something to eat while I'm there. So I'm just quickly nipping down now. It is a Sunday, so I wasn't sure what would actually be open at it's like half past nine, ten o'clock on a Sunday morning. But thankfully this little Sainsbury's is. Hey everyone, we're now on day two. I ended up, I was gonna vlog going to the shops yesterday and just finish the vlog off a little bit and then do day two today. But I completely forgot to finish the vlog. Um, ended up getting home really, really late. So I thought, do you know what? We'll just join it on straight away from today. So today I'm gonna to be working down with the goats and the pygmies. I've got some people coming over now for the first session, so I'll catch up with you guys soon. But welcome to day two. Hi 
We've just finished with the first session of the day and I'm gonna go and get the girls' presents wrapped. I'm trying to do it sneaky so they don't see me. Um, I've got them in my car, so I'm gonna go wrap those now. I've got like 15, 20 minutes, I think, till the next one starts, so I've gotta be quick. I also need to try to get them past the house without them seeing, because one of them is quite big. The kids came back. We're now on to slot number two, so I need to finish wrapping later on. That music is so loud. I need to finish wrapping later on. I'm gonna go down to the bottom of the field now to go and help some people out holding goats and things like that. We've got poor little baby Rose. Her mum died recently, which is so, so sad. Um, so she's just wandering around bleating, looking for her mum. Um, but yeah, gonna go help some people out. It is looking so festive. Look at the little donkeys having some hair. Beth has just made me a hot chocolate, which I'm very, very grateful for. We have almost finished our second set of sessions. I'm gonna try wrap the Christmas presents now. Um, really enjoying this though. I feel like I've got quite a few escapees today. You won't be able to see on camera, so I'll take a video and set it for you. We'll have a lot of little escapee goats today. But yeah, it's currently about half past two, so I might go get some grapes as well because I'm getting a little bit hungry. We do finish a little bit later on today because we've got some more sessions in today. We're also going to be doing the 23rd and the 24th of December as well, but I'm not going to be here for those because I'll be back at my house. But yeah, we've got another two sessions after this. It's weird not living here anymore, but still coming and doing like the farm events and stuff. It's really weird. I also look very, very messy, but it's vlogging, so it's realistic. So this is what I do look like on a daily basis. We are on the last session of the day. Oh my God, that literally made me jump. So that is it. That is our second session over. So I'm heading home now. I do apologize about the quality. Obviously I couldn't charge my camera and it's my phone quality, so it's not the best in the world. But thank you so much for watching this video. It's been about all over the place again. It's what my vlogs seem to be, but I hope you've all enjoyed this. If you have, don't forget to smash that thumbs up button. Leave me a lovely little comment in the comment section down below. And make sure to subscribe to my channel for more content just like this. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye. Thank you.